can't believe I didn't see this coming.
Gotta make uh, uh. I gotta take care of this.
You're in the Vanguard, right? Hey, thanks for your service. latest returns. I trust you've got what I wanted? I'll always say the best thing about working with Ryujin is you never fail to come through. Things aren't always flawless, but the end result is always beneficial. It's been a pleasure. And tell Dalton I'll expect he'll send me any updates on this little situation of his, should it have any effect on my business. someone who gives a damn. Thank you. 
Need to move some merch. This is the place. Need something? Always happy to take your money. here. Time to move on. Well, look who's back. So tell me, what did you find out? Inside the Syndicate? That area's off limits, and I think we both know why. Imogene knew exactly what she was doing when she went there. <laughs> if you think I'm paying for that information, think again. It's just a matter of time before it finds its way onto my desk. And I can be a very patient person. <sighs> I had a feeling you'd say that. Enjoy your time with Dalton. It'll all trickle back to me sooner or later. I hate waiting. It's just more time to doubt myself. <coughs> they know how to make a client feel welcome up here.
Don't cause any trouble. You're back. And Imogene? So you did find her, and yet failed to bring her in. I'm looking forward to this explanation. Of course. We've scrubbed security footage and run through access card permissions and found nothing. The project itself is an enormous security risk, but our lead R&D engineer, Vina Kara, has been working on ways to mitigate this. If I'm not mistaken, you appear to be on her side. Not that I blame you, but if Imogen really wants to prove her innocence, she better be prepared to face a strict interrogation. Now, I need to undertake the laborious task of writing up a report to summarize all of this. In the meantime, Masako has requested your presence in R&D. She wants you to meet her in Vinakara's office. Vina's the head of our research and development team. She's the creator of Project Dominion, and often considered the protege of Ray de Caris, Ryujin's founder. Just take the elevator down to research and development. You'll find Dr. Kara's office to your left as you enter the floor. Masako's been focusing on how to deal with Infinity LTD and their knowledge of Project Dominion. I believe her plans rely heavily on you. Once I've examined this evidence, I may need your help in moving forward. And not a word about this to anyone. I'll present what I have to the board once I've completed a full report. I've been waiting here for ages. Keep out of my way, and I'll keep out of yours. I need that Rothesite if we want to complete the Neuroamp. I'm just concerned the entire station was wiped out by... something. Don't worry. We'll figure it out and get that shipment back. I hope we're keeping you busy. Good. You're here. It's time to put a plan in motion to take full control of this situation with Infinity LTD. In due time, we don't know to what extent Infinity has taken the current NeuroAmp schematics, 
So our top priority is completing our own. Let me introduce you to Vina Kalra, Head of Research and Development. She'll give you the initial details. Yes, details. You see, the internal neuroamp is supposed to consist of two parts. The first part, the part Infinity stole, handles the manipulative effects. The second part is a shielding modification designed to protect the user against other neuroamp... users. Well, we can't, but the shielding aspect was never officially a part of Project Dominion. It was an afterthought of how to safeguard our own people from being manipulated, so it was being researched separately as a mod. The research itself was in early stages, too early for board approval, so only myself, Demarcus, and Masako know about it. Oh yeah, marketing and finance wouldn't have it any other way. No one wants their greatest asset used against them. Once Vina can complete the internal neuroamp and shielding mod, the plan is to outfit you with both and have you infiltrate Infinity LTD. We can't risk the assignment until we know your mind has the necessary protection. You're a Ryujin employee, and we need a job done. We've trusted you this far, so I feel it's safe to continue the trend. We expect our employees to do whatever it takes to ensure Ryujin's success. Consider this an opportunity, not a risk. Besides, you're in good hands with Vina. Good. I'm glad you see this as an opportunity. And I love a willing subject. Now it's just a matter of getting the key ingredient. The final kink in both designs was finding compatible materials to use for conductivity that the human body wouldn't reject. I've finally created the perfect alloy, but it requires a newly discovered refined element called rothesite. Which is where I come in. We have a confidential contract with Consolidated Mining to gather, refine, and ship the rothesite straight to us. Their last shipment is late, and neither we nor Consolidated Mining have had any communication with the Karenay Station. Correct. The updates have been regular up until now. Last we heard, the shipment was ahead of schedule. We need you to head out there, secure the shipment, and bring it back here so Vina can complete her prototype. And I want to know what happened. We need to take any safety measures to make sure this doesn't happen again. Unfortunately, yes, so be prepared. Extensive tests and research were done on the planet, so the chances that this is environmental are slim. And setting up a station like this is second nature for consolidated mining, with plenty of redundancies in place to handle mechanical failures. The mining station is CM Station RC-1. It's on a moon called Karen A-3A in the Karen A system. The shipment should be in the research and control tower, but the outside doors are kept locked down. This keycard will let you enter the mines so you can access the tower from the inside. Good luck. All right, relax. This experiment can't go worse than the last one did.
someone attacked the Genardyne power facility in Neon. interested.
Next time you see Barrett, try it out on him. Starting landing procedure. I'm ready to make some waves. <laughs> Cora will be thrilled. Well, not every rock is swimming in nitrogen and O2. Just doing the mining thing. The mining scanner doohickey. I know so much about mining, can you tell? If it gets cold enough, your spit can freeze. Not that I know that from personal experience. All right, I know it from personal experience.
I to drop a few pounds, and I don't mean a diet. This is my favorite part.
get your blood pumping, huh? I ain't never getting used to that. That thing is massive. I assume it's big. It's, this has got to be big even for a miner, right? I 
even manage to carry all that? Look who it is. Complete. We're in orbit. If something's on your mind, you can tell me. The clinic's a bit of a legend in the medical field. This area's off limits, authorized personnel only. Yeah, I bet you do. Well, that's... thank you. Yeah, sure they do. 
Easy. We're just talking, right? Fine. I'll issue you an access card. Infinity better get it together. Sean, I don't want to go over this again. I'm tired, all right? Just not today. You can't be okay with this, though, right? You took an oath, and I'd say this is a firm violation. Look, we got that shipment. Although, who knows what Faye expects me to do with it. But maybe approvals really are on the way. Now, please, get back to Kai. Make sure his vitals are stable. I don't want to lose him. We'll figure this out. I promise. Fine. But if we lose Kai, that's it. I'm going to SSNN. I don't give a shit about my career anymore. You and me both. Just have to get through this day. Hey, who let you in here? This is a restricted area. I don't need to tell you anything. This whole wing is restricted. I think you need to leave before I'm forced to call security. You think I'm just gonna give you confidential information? I appreciate that you really know where I'm coming from. You've got a point. All right. Maybe there really is some good that can come out of this. We're on a private contract with Infinity LTD. It's for something they call Project Dominion. Dr. Lane and I were instructed to conduct human trials on several... volunteers. So far, only one patient has survived. Not everyone can afford NeuroAmp technology. When it comes to the possibility of getting one for free, we had plenty of candidates to choose from. They understood the risks. We just never thought chance of failure would be so high. You're telling me? When Infinity hired us, they said human trial authorization was already underway and we'd have the approvals in a matter of days. The days went by and nothing. Every time we'd ask, it was always just days away, but we kept working. Between the money and potential success, it was easy to tell ourselves that they'd come through. Sean, what the hell is going on here? Who is this? You think we stood by and did nothing? We did everything we could to save them. You've no idea how many hours we spent in surgery and how closely we monitored each and every one of them. This is a research facility where research is being done. We just need more time and experimentation. Sean spoke the truth. We thought the approval would arrive any day, so we continued with the project. By the time we started to catch on, it was already too late. We were too immersed in the lie. Dear Lord, you ever stop and think to pull the plug on it, approvals or not? This, this was flat out murder. I think you're being a little over dramatic here. No, he's right, Ken. It's what you and I both deserve after going along with this mess. How long have we talked about walking away or refusing to work? We oversaw the death of nine people here, and it may as well be ten. Infinity may have lied to us, but they also paid us well enough that we did nothing. You'd let some stranger like this just ruin our careers? Yes, and you're going to let them too. Go ahead. Get whatever information you need to take this place and Infinity down. I'll make sure Dr. Lane remains cooperative. Heaven is having a smooth running ship. I was meaning to check in with Cora anyway. Make sure your ship's still in one piece.
Sure, just keep grabbing everything. What could go wrong? It's a strange feeling, knowing you're living through some back in action. <laughs>